Uh, Francis, just kind of get your, your thoughts on the game there last night. Uh, got behind early, but a uh, nice comeback there, second and third, and maybe a little bit of luck that that game turns out differently. Uh, yeah, well, the, the, the key is to play 60 minutes. I don't think we did last night. I think we only played 40 minutes. Uh, I think that's what we're going to bring tomorrow. Uh, just a game that we're going to play 60 minutes as a team and uh, bring that uh, chemistry we have out, 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 outside the ice and bring in, in, on the ice. It's gonna, we're going to be fine. What, what seemed to be clicking for you guys there, certainly offensively in the second and third, seemed like all, all four lines were uh, generating offensive chances. Uh, we were just uh, moving our feet. We were going on a four-check, creating some chances. Uh, we need to bury those chances, and uh, that's, that's what we're going to do tomorrow. You know, how, how key is it when you face a little bit of adversity here these last few games just to kind of lean on uh, a support system, whether it's teammates, the coaching staff, or even family this time of the year? I just going to get us prepared for the playoffs. I mean, uh, it's, it's always good to, to face some adversity. And uh, like I said, it's just going to get us ready for the playoffs, and uh, we're going to work from, from here. How do you feel like your game's developed here uh, since the beginning of training camp and certainly here recently for the opportunity to uh, play some top line minutes these last two games? Oh, I mean, it's nice uh, playing with those guys. It's, 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 it's a lot for me, uh, just playing some minutes. It's, it's crucial for me, just uh, moving my feet, being good on the forecheck, uh, throwing some bodies around. And I just, I just need to keep moving my feet and being, being good on the forechecks, and that's how I'm going to create my chances, and that's how my minutes are going to go up. And that's been a, from what I've seen, a big part of your game is uh, kind of generating energy on the forecheck. How much pride do you take in that and trying to kind of just get your team excited there in those kinds of situations? Uh, that's, that's, I mean, scoring goals for me, it's, it's pretty much like you said, bringing energy in a game. And uh, that's what I need to do every game, every shifts. And that's what I'm going to bring tomorrow to, to bring some energy so we uh, can build on that and just move forward. And just how much have you enjoyed uh, this year, the success you guys have had, but certainly the, the people that you've uh, been able to interact with in the locker room? Oh, it's very nice. I mean, uh, I came here last year at the end of the year, and it's pretty much the same group of guys almost. Um, Cormie, Kramer, all the all the veterans like this. Uh, it's it's nice to be around them. They they know the league. They know uh, how how to be a professional. And I'm just uh, I just look at them, and I'm just trying to, to do what 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 they're doing to to <clears throat> to be able to to make a career out of it. You know the the crowd there Monday over 8,000 people in attendance downtown. I just what was that experience like and uh, having some real big crowds over the last couple of years uh, in downtown? Uh, it's it's for sure fun to see uh, people coming through a game. I mean, uh, uh, we were uh, we were first in the uh, in the ranking. People were coming and others still coming even if we we're facing adversity. So it's nice to to have them behind us. Uh, so we just we just hope they're gonna be there for us when uh, it's gonna be playoff time and at the end of the season. Now, Moose, have retro day coming up here. Do you have any uh, favorite memories, either playing hockey growing up, you and your brother, or uh, maybe just teams that you, you watched uh, with your family as a young child? Well, obviously, me playing with my brother when I was uh, 20, was 16, it was a huge, uh, huge step for a family. I mean, uh, I, was, I wasn't supposed to. I asked for a trade, so I ended up playing with him. Uh, it was nice to, to finally play with him. I didn't think I was going to be able to when I was younger, but... Uh, um, I, I was fortunate to play with him, and now um, when I look at him, he's being in the NHL right now. So he's, he's, he's now a model for me, so that's, that's nice to see him there.